got asthma. I can't handle this. Sarah. Yeah, just um, put it on the counter, will you? Okay. I'm I'm sorry. It's this is just really frustrating for me sometimes. I wouldn't know. Uh, I, I just need another requisition form. No, you know what? I'm I, I'm not going to give this one to you. Why? Why not? So I'm gonna go with you this time. Let's go. Come on, soldier. See if you can keep up with me. Yeah, right. When's the last time you went on a run? I mean, you know, out in the shit. Hey, I've done supply runs like anyone else. I gotta admit, it's been a while. Do you even have a bike? Yeah, but uh, <clears throat> I think I'm gonna ride with you on this run. No chance of us getting separated that way. Yes, ma'am. Stop with. The... Hey, you uh, you been inside the ark yet? Uh, the caves here. Yeah, I got the grand tour when I arrived from the colonel himself. Come on, even you got to give the man some credit for the vision, it's stockpiling, preparing, saving what we can. Yeah, well, I'll give him this. This island is a goddamn fortress. Nothing's gonna get in here without a hell of a fight. Exactly. Here, this is my tent. Wow, nice place. It's got that woman's touch. All right. I'm hardly ever here, and most nights I usually spend it on a cot in the lab. Look at this. This'll get the job done. It was a gift from Matt when I first joined up. Matt? The Colonel. Oh, Jesus, come on, Deacon. It's just a gun. Come on. Let's go this way. I want to show you something. Following you. When I got here, the militia had cut down almost every tree on the island. I asked Matt, the Colonel, to save the last one. Oh, yeah? Well, why did you, uh, do that? Do you remember the weekend we rode up here? To Crater Lake, I mean, after we got married. Uh, yeah, I, I, I remember. I remember thinking, God, when Mount Mazama blew up, I mean, how long did it take for the lava to cool and the soil to form, all these trees to grow? When all this is over, when we leave this fucking island, I want there to be at least one tree left. Uh, listen, these guys don't give a shit about any of that. I've, I've been through their dead zone. Look, the Colonel's focused on winning the war. The sooner I do my part, the sooner he'll stop burning everything to the ground. What's wrong? No, nothing. It's just... <laughs> Never mind. <clears throat> Hold on, uh... Hold on tight. There's a community college east of here. Off the highway. You know the one? Yeah, yeah. Uh... Let's take the south bridge. It'll be faster. I'm with you. Hey, so I gotta ask, uh, all this stuff, the, the yeast, the silicon... Why do I need it? The weapon I'm working on is a viricide. If I can isolate the virus that causes the cells to mutate, I can kill it. Okay. Yeah, 
Keep it together. Yes, Sergeant. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Why are you not working hard? Why are you still in my obstacle course? Why are you not finished with my obstacle course? Do you like it? Can I ask you something? After that night in Farewell, what happened? I mean, how did you get out? Well, we almost didn't. After the feds pulled out, anyone still alive started putting up roadblocks of their own, and they started shooting people on sight. We somehow made it to that refugee camp where we, were, we thought that you were going to be waiting, but like I said, it was gone. So we tried a few others, same story. No survivors, everything overrun. So within a week, the whole damn valley was a war zone. People were killing each other over scraps of food, sometimes killing each other for no reason at all. If Boozer and I hadn't stuck together, I don't think we would have made it. Wait, Boozer? He's alive? Where is he? What happened to him? Yes, he's alive, but he's he's at a camp up north. He can't ride anymore because, because he lost his arm. But uh, But he is alive. I'm so glad he's alive. I, I'm really sorry. I, I should have asked you about him sooner. Don't worry about it. Okay, uh, my turn. Look, it's gonna sound stupid, but um, that night in Farewell, my mongrel's ring. Do you still have it? Deacon, I'm sorry. It's the Colonel's policy. They, they confiscate all jewelry when you come into the camp. They melt down the gold and silver to use in Weaver's project or whatever the hell. I forgot all about it. I'm, I'm really sorry. Uh, no, don't worry about it. I don't know. I was just thinking out loud. It doesn't matter. Here, I think this is it. been here before? Once. Before, you know, career day. They invited me to give a presentation on exciting careers in biochemistry. God. What? Nothing. Just looking back, it should have been a talk on how to survive the end of the world. Come on. How are we going to get through this? Should we find a way around? No, uh, hold on. I can boost you up there. You ready? Yeah. Got it? <clears throat> Got it. Here, watch your head. Got it. <clears throat> Jesus, what the hell happened here? This is one of the earliest survivor camps, set up before they figured out that hordes like to run along the main highways. It was dead long before I got here. This entire place is gonna be crawling. Yeah. Do you know where we're going? Like I said, I've only been here once, but I think the science building is back there. The whole place down in this. We don't even know what's in there. Well, we know what's in there, but you goddamn news. Now, come on, let's just go around. We're not getting through here. No. Whoever was living here jamming the place up pretty good. How about through here? The door's locked, but it doesn't look fair. Can you jimmy it? Here, let me try. I think I can get this there. Got it. Through here, looks clear. Coming.
Here, uh, help me move this. Hold on, okay. You ready? Push! Are you ready? Yeah, let's go. Oh shit! Back, 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 back. Yeah. All right, well, let me find another way. No, wait a second, wait a second. We can do this. What? We can do this. Uh, if we both go out there, we're just gonna pull them down on top of each other, so... Wait a second, what if you come up on top of here, you lay down covering fire, <laughs> you take out the strikers, I'll take out the rest. Are you sure about this? Yeah, 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 I do this all the time. Just keep up a steady stream of fire, all right? Deacon. Once I'm through, just close this up tight. Come on down. It's clear. Are you okay? God, Jesus, that was a little too close. No, we had it all the way. Gunfire's gonna bring in more. Yeah, we'll be long gone by then. Where now? Uh, I don't know. Uh, they got the place barricaded up pretty good. Uh, see if there's a hole in any of these walls. Place where we can climb up. All right, I'll look over here. Anything? No. Hey, over here, there's an open window. Coming. You got it? I got it. Hold on, let me find something. Ah, uh, Sarah? Hold on. I gotta find something I can throw down. Oh, shit! Oh, Deacon! Oh, shit, shit, shit! God damn it! Ah, uh, just find something for me to climb on! out. I got a use for you. to school. Oh, yeah, well. And now you finally got your way. <laughs> well, better late than never. Oh, okay. Thanks. You ready? Mm-hmm. Let's go. All right. Here, let me go first this time. Yes, ma'am. Whatever you say. It's like a bomb went off in here. Maybe one did. Come on, I think we can get through here. The door's jammed. Here, here, here. I got this, I got it. See, I told you. See, like I said, I got this. Yeah, yeah. Good job. Thanks. How badly do you need this piece of equipment? All right, we're almost there. Look, we're not giving up now. I'm just asking. Wow, no, 
Now we know how the freaks were getting in. Someone needed to learn how to park. It looks clear. Oh, shit! More barricades, and they're everywhere. Huh. Uh, check the buildings. I can see the science building. It's over there. Just gotta get through these barriers. Following you. Yeah, be right there. Got it. Coming. Here, let me boost you up again. Uh, only this time you... Don't take so long finding something for you to climb. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Try not to attract any more swarmers this time, all right? Sure, yeah, I'll see what I can do. so many of them. I just kept coming. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You're okay. Come on. I'm fine. Come on, we're almost there. This is the science building. Yeah, it looks like this place has been shut up tight from the inside. Come on, there's got to be a way in. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah. I've killed freaks before. No, I know, I know. It's just... Deacon, I'm fine. Let's go. Come on, this way. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. Let's check this door. Can you open it? No, it's jammed from the inside. 
Let's go around the building. There has to be a way in. I'm telling you, someone sealed it tight from the inside. Well, we gotta check, right? Locked. It's okay. jammed like all the rest. Another way. Oh, shit. Wait, sorry. Hold on, hold on for a second. Those are... Those are newts. They're inside. Those are newts in there, which means... There's gotta be a way from the roof. Come on. Come on, the roof's low over here. Yep, we just have to find a way up. Sarah, here, uh, help me push this. We can use it to climb up. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Hold up. You got it? Yeah. Okay, be ready. Newts can get pretty nasty when you trespass on their territory. I just really wish I didn't have to kill the little shits. What? What do you mean? You remind me of that little girl. The one in Farewell. The one that fucking stabbed you? She didn't know what she was doing. None of them know what they're doing. Won't stop them from killing you. I know. Look out! I got him! God damn it! That's the last of them. You enjoyed that? Well, I killed Newt's. No, but, I mean, you gotta admit, they're pretty goddamn annoying. You're right about that. Here, give me your hand. Okay. <clears throat> Careful. Steady. Try living like them. See how you smell after two years. No thanks. Where, where, where are we going? Try these doors. Here. Is that the uh, centrifuge you were looking for? 
Yep, this is it. Come on. Okay. It's gonna get. Let's move. Okay. Yeah. All right, I got it. Let's go. Deacon, stay down. Yeah, got it. You got any more of those smoke grenades? Yeah. We're up here, you can see the entire park. I watch where I'm going, and then you throw the grenades ahead of me. You got it? Got it. Okay, let's do this.
saw something. I think that's the last of them. Okay, hold on. You all right? Am I all right? What's wrong with you? Oh, I don't know. It's just that I remember the day that I met you. You fired my gun in the air to scare those rednecks, and you're so scared you couldn't stop shaking. Yeah, well, lots changed since then. <clears throat> Come on, let's get the hell out of here. What uh, happened to you, sir? What's that supposed to mean? Hey, look, I get it. A lot's changed. Everyone we knew is gone, but it doesn't explain. Explain what, Deacon? Why everyone in the good old boys club calls me the Wizard Island Witch? Look, I don't give a shit about any of that. I... Nothing's happened to me that hasn't happened to every other fucking person on this planet. Yeah. Okay, if you say so. Hey, don't leave me here. I'm not going anywhere. Hey, this way. Got it. This will help. Can I say thank you? No. <laughs> okay. You know, I just wanted to let you know how much I needed this. You're welcome.
What's up? What's up with you? Hey, you're not supposed to be here. My brothers and sisters in arms, I stand here before you in celebration. The end is nigh. Yeah. Captain Curry has been working non-stop assembling and training our army. Lieutenant Whitaker has been working tirelessly on a biological weapon that will allow us to kill hundreds yeah. of freaks at once. Lieutenant Weaver is working on a chemical weapon that will allow us to burn down entire hordes. Soon, slash and burn will be a thing of the past. We will go from fighting a defensive war That's right. to yeah, an yeah. offensive yeah. war yeah. as we take the fight to the freaks, as we work to retake our world. I could sleep for days. And behold, he said, the enemy who sowed them is the devil. And the harvest is the end of the age. And the reapers are angels. And they will gather out of his kingdom all evil. Yeah. And throw them into the furnace of fire. In that place there will be weeping and wailing and gnashing of teeth. We, the Deschutes County Militia, are those avenging yeah, angels, yeah, yeah, yeah. and we are coming. Company dismissed. Taylor, what's going on? Man, can you believe this shit? Fucking Captain Curry's got me on guard duty. Don't like, something's gonna happen to the dock around. in the middle yeah, of all this. Yeah, it's a tough job, but I'm sure you got it covered. All right? Yeah, yeah. Hey, what's going on with you, man? You got some, uh, some saddle sores or something? Need a dock to lube you all up? How's the ear? What? I can't hear you. <laughs> I'm just fucking with you, man. I'm feeling no pain, brother. Doc's got me on some oxy. Shit, it's tight. I'm fine, man. I'm fine. Oh, hey, uh, I saw the lieutenant earlier. She was trying to get something from the dock. Yeah? Yeah, I thought you'd want to know. All right, well, thanks. See you around, Taylor. Yeah, man. Estarás bien. You'll be fine. Just don't start any bar fights. <laughs> no promises, Doc. <laughs> you know, me parece... It's... I was thinking it's been a while since I've been in the shit. I'm getting soft. Estoy hablando. <laughs> Are you kidding? Oh, you're serious. You want to go on a run with me? I used to ride myself before the world went to hell, you know. All right, well, let's go. Corporal? Doc? Going someplace? Coronel, it's been a while since I've been on a run. I was going to go oh, in Corpo no, no, no. I don't think so. Cor Coronel? No entiendo. I don't know what I'd do if I lost you. If anything were to happen to you, you can't be replaced. This Sir, I can look out for him. You Dismissed, Corporal. <laughs> Matt, I've been out in this shit before. I understand. But again, if anything were to happen to you, I... I don't know what I'd do if I... I don't know what I'd do if I lost you. That's it, that's as far as I can go. How can I help? You can't, unless you have a DNA synthesizer somewhere. 
no, but uh, there's an auto parts store near Fort Klamath. See, if I could you check can't out. get what I need there, you. How do you think I would learn? I actually think I know where you can get one. Really? Yeah, your old lab, Cloverdale. Okay, yeah, that's great. All we have to do is find a way over the mountains. Yeah, you're right. That would be impossible. Oh my God, you know a way over, don't you? Good, you can take me. Is that an order, Lieutenant? Yes. No, I'm just, I mean, no, it's not an well, order. Which is it? Oh, well, I don't know. Are you gonna take me or not? Dress warm, pack light. Hey, Deke. Oh my God, if you say thank you one more time, I... Let me know when you're ready to go. Going somewhere, Lieutenant? Colonel, Captain. Yes, we're heading out to retrieve a piece of equipment that I need. I see. How's your work progressing? Good. Good, with D Corporal St. John's help, I've been able to make some good progress. Thank you for assigning him to my project. Well, Lieutenant Weaver's also been making progress. He says he'll be ready to test his chemical weapon by the end of the week. I heard. Mine will be ready soon. You realize you are more valuable than any piece of equipment. Equipment can be replaced. You cannot. I've been in the ship before, Matt. You know that I can handle myself. Carry on, Lieutenant. Corporal. I'd like to see Weaver's equipment right now. I'd like to see what he's doing. that all about anyway what all the yes sirs and no sirs and the saluting and the ranks and the uniforms just seems kind of pointless you know considering hey you're in the army once you should know that was different how well there were more people in the world i don't know i mean having a military made more sense i think it makes more sense now why it's utter fucking chaos out here we need the order and discipline or we're not gonna make it you know, I've been at plenty of camps that are doing just fine without having a colonel breathing down their necks. You know what's funny? About uniforms and ranks seeming pointless, I mean? No, oh, what? I used to think the same thing about the MC. I mean, you guys had ranks like road captain and president. I mean, you wore badges and patches and, and tats like uniforms. I mean, when you guys used to all ride together, you looked like an army. Well, except for the beards and bikes. Now that you mention it, I, I can see your point. You know, I'm actually surprised you weren't wearing the cut when you came into the camp. I didn't think anything would make you give that up. Even the end of the world. Okay, so my cut, huh? We're gonna have to see if the colonel will let me switch uniforms. You know, there is that. Where are we heading? Diamond Lake. There's an old forest service road that winds around the western base of Mount Tielsen. Okay. Soldiers stationed there were having a uh, bear problems. Bear problems? Hey! Hey! Shut it off! You're gonna have to turn around, buddy. We got orders to keep anyone from. To keep anyone from what, Corporal? I'm sorry, ma'am. I didn't see it was you. It's, it's the Colonel, ma'am. He's given us orders to keep an eye out for anyone going AWOL. Are you accusing me of going AWOL? No, ma'am. 
Then get out of my way. Corporal, what are you still doing there? Get the hell out of my way! Yes, ma'am. I'm sorry, ma'am. Jesus. I'll have to report this. Yeah, you do that. Well, that sounds serious! What do you mean? Well, he said he's gonna report you. I mean, how's Matt gonna take that? The Colonel will tell him to mind his own fucking business and to never question an officer. Wrong. Nothing, it's just... I mean, the view up here, it, it's incredible. Uh, yeah. I guess I just don't see it anymore. Uh, pay attention to it, I mean. How can you not? It's, it's breathtaking. Yeah, the world wakes up, grateful for another dawn. Hey, if you spent all day staring into a microscope, you might appreciate it more. Oh, I appreciate it. You know, being around when the morning comes up is a hell of a lot better than the alternative. I gotta be honest. You know, there were times when I didn't believe that. About, you know, hoping to see another day. Yeah, I know the feeling. What kept you going? I mean, back then. Um, I, I don't know. Just, uh, too goddamn stubborn to give up, I think. I don't believe you. I did give up, Sarah. I did. And then, I, I don't know. Boozer's arm got fucked up. And I had to, I, I, I mean, I wasn't going to let him die, you know? So, watching him struggle to keep going when he had no reason, no fucking reason at all. I guess I didn't want to... I didn't want to let him down. So I, I didn't want to go out that way. And then I found out that that you were still alive in that. That's, that's when I really wanted to... That's when I really wanted to kill myself. Yeah, right. No, seriously. But uh, then I remembered you still have my mongrel's ring. That's, that's what kept me going. Figured I'd look you up, get it back. You know how that turned out. Shit. Exactly. Things are gonna get better, you know that, right? Yeah. Yeah. We can win this thing, Deacon. We can. Are you trying to convince me or you? We must be getting close, right? Yeah, we're coming up on the Tielsen Tunnel. We need your help to move that out of the way. How is that? That is a sigil. It's a warning sign from the Rippers. What's a Ripper? Rippers. Rest in peace. They were a cult. They cut themselves. They worshipped the freaks. They wanted to be like them. And, um, <laughs> you could see what happened if you didn't want to be like them. How do we deal with them if we run into them? We ain't gonna run into them. You can help me move this or what? Yeah, sure. Okay, hang on. This is gonna be a tight squeeze. Jesus. No wonder everyone gave up their cars. This is nothing. There's a tunnel up in the old Belknap Road that Boozer and I rode through all the time. Traffic had been backed up at a narrow checkpoint for about a mile when everything got overrun. Sounds horrible. I seem worse, but yeah.
this looks familiar. Yeah, yeah, it's right up here. Wow. I never thought I'd see this place again. Okay, all right, the power's still on. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me. There's a solar array on the main rooftop. I think I also heard rumors about a nuclear-powered generator, but I never saw it. Okay, well, how the hell are we gonna get in? Yeah, I'll show you. Like you said, power's still on, right? Sarah Irene Whitaker, ID 2007659. Well, you guys are a little more high-tech than I remember. It's not really that impressive. Aerie's not intelligent. She's like a souped-up smartphone app. It's Aerie. Artificial intelligence response interface. <clears throat> oh, my God. What is it? Nothing. It's... What the hell? Look at this. There's so much food here. Sarah, this should be... It, it, it's the irrigation system. It's all self-automated. So as long as the power's on, this is self-sustaining. Oh, wow. Well, shit. This place has everything. It's got food. It's got water. It's got power. It's got a big fucking fence. I'm surprised no one is uh, camped out here. Well, it's like you said. The power is still on. That's 8,000 volts telling everyone to keep the fuck out. <gasps> See? Come on. Infected. It's what's made them so hyper aggressive. That makes them a pain in my ass. I think we should be okay as long as we're quiet. Okay. Come on. What the hell happened here? I don't know. What? Sarah, these, uh, these people all worked here, right? Did you know them? Yeah. Yeah, I knew him. Let's go, come on. So someone shot them all as they were what? Trying to leave? I mean, yeah, it looks like it. And then they just locked the place up tight and they left. Why would they do that? I don't know, Deacon. I don't know, I wasn't here. Sarah Irene Whitaker, ID 2007659. Shit. This one's not working. Come on, there's another one over here. So, okay, so why is, um, what'd you call it, Aerie? Why is Aerie working at the front gate and not the front door? 
Honestly, I'm surprised she's working at all. I remember the guys in the IT department constantly complaining about the system going down, and th that was with weekly maintenance. And <laughs> now it's been, what, two years? Damn it, I, I don't understand why these aren't working. Hey, sir, what? you know how you just said that no one could get in here? Yeah? Why? Maybe they're already here. <gasps> Motherfucker. My god, you're right. They've locked me out. Hey! Hey, let us in! We're not here to hurt you, and we're not here to stay! Oh god, let us in! Is there another way in? Yeah. Yeah, I've got an idea. Come on. There's a fire escape in the back of the maintenance building. But why won't they have that locked out, too? We don't know that they've locked out anything. I mean, it's probably just a glitch. The emergency exits can't be locked out. They're part of Cloverdale's safety protocols. Here, this is it. I just have to figure out how to get up there. Hold on, hold on. Uh, I can shoot the latch. Good shot. You done that before? Yeah, once or twice. Why don't you let me go in first? I don't know what happened back there in the parking lot, but I'm telling you, there's no way anyone could have gotten in past this fence. I know these people, and if Jim's in there, he's gonna Jim, let us in. Jim? Jim, the Renicop Jim? <sighs> Jim who almost shot me when I tried to pick you Deacon, up? that was so long ago, and a lot's changed since then. <sighs> yeah, not for the better. Sarah Irene Whitaker, ID 2007659. See, I told you. Those other doors must have been bugged or something. Ready? Get down. Mother fuck you. were saying? Yeah. Enough is worth stopping anything. Trust no one. Expect the worst. I'm beginning to see your point out. Alert. Stay up here and give me cover. Do whatever you want. This is right. Got it. Security you in the If you get a clear shot, will you shoot those goddamn speakers? Your voice is driving me fucking crazy. I'm with you there. Warning. Deadly force is authorized for use against all trespassers. Warning. Deadly force is authorized. Multiple shots have been fired. 
Security personnel to the maintenance it's locked. building. Locked. Hold on. Sarah Irene Whitaker, ID 2007659. Sarah Irene Whitaker, security has been breached. The Cloverdale facility is in lockdown. Warning. Repeat. Deadly force is Override. ID 2007659. Override. Deadly security force protocol is authorized. Alpha 761 has been overridden. Oh, God, shut the fuck up already. They must not have locked out under security. Are you ready? Yeah, this time, Alert. let me go in first. Alert. Hey, this time, has been called. we go in together. Police are on their way. Stand down, Wonderful. and you will not be harmed. <laughs> Shit. Snipers up there on the roof. I see him. Alert. Alert. Out. This is a level four alarm. Multiple shots have been fired. I'll take that. Security personnel to the maintenance building. There's more of them! I see them! Deadly force is authorized for use against all trespassers. Warning. Deadly force is authorized. One more time. Alert. Sarah Irene Alert. Walker, ID 2007659. Security Police override. Police are on their way. Fucking voice Stand voice. down and you will not be harmed. Well, ready? Yeah. Alert! Alert! Jim, this wait! Is a level That's four son alarm. of a bitch! Multiple well, shots like you said, fired. a lot's Security changed. Security personnel to the maintenance building. Let's make sure it's clear. Yeah, on it. It's clear here. Warning. Deadly force Nothing here. is authorized for use against <laughs> all trespassers. Warning. Deadly force is authorized. Alert. Same here. Alert. 911 has been called. Police are on their way. Stand down and. Okay, it's clear. Alert. They're waiting for Alert. Us. This is a level four alarm. Multiple shots have been fired. Security personnel Come to on, the main. Let's try the door. Building. Sarah Irene Whitaker, ID 2007659, security override and disable the fucking voice response. Access denied. Sarah Irene Whitaker, Warning. your Deadly security is clearance has been for use revoked. against all trespassers. Please see an IT Warning. administrator Deadly for assistance. Is authorized. Fucking bitch! Hey, hey, going in that way would have been a death trap anyway. Every gun on the other side of that door is aimed right here. We need a better plan. Alert. Alert. Oh yeah, you got one. Nine one one has been oh, called. Maybe. Police are on. Uh, like, is there a way to that rooftop from here? Not be harmed. Over here. Hey, there's a ledge out here. You should be able to climb up to the roof from that AC unit. Alert. Alert. You mean you should this be able to climb up from there? Listen, I Multiple want you to go up there, fired. lay down suppressing Security fire, keep their attention. When they're all building. looking up, I'm gonna go in from here. I'm gonna take it by surprise. Okay, yeah, that's a really good plan. But uh, there's, uh, there's one problem with it. What's that? The door's Warning. locked out. Remember? Deadly force is authorized oh, for use shit. against Come on. all trespassers. Come on, I have an idea. Warning. Deadly force what? is authorized. <laughs> Alert. Alert. 911 has Put your hand on that reader. Police are on Wait, their way. Doing? Stand down. And yes, will not be harmed. Okay, they locked out security, but they forgot the admin codes. From this station, I can get you a temporary access code. All right, here's your ID code. Ready? Uh, Alert. Yeah. Alert. This your full is name and ID five four two nine zero zero nine. You got fired. that? Security personnel. Uh, five four two nine zero zero nine. Uh, is that right? Yeah. Let's go. Authorized for use against all trespassers. Warning, deadly force is authorized. Here, I'm gonna need you to help me up. Okay, hold on. <laughs> alert, alert. 
911 has been called. <laughs> Police are on their way. Stand down and you will not be harmed. Ready? Yep. <clears throat> you got it? <clears throat> yeah. Wait until I get their attention, then Alert. you go in. Alert. Hey, this is a don't take any chances. Alarm. Multiple shots have been you kidding me? Security These days, personnel to the maintenance do. building. Okay. Go. Deacon Lee, St. John, ID 54290 Deacon Lee, St. John. Welcome to Clover Station. Facility. This is your first Come on! Get her! Damn it, listen to me! Damn it, you will not. Damn it, listen to me! Alarm. Multiple shots have been fired. Security personnel to the main building. said hands all right all right just just tell me what you want okay all right he's clean we were just defending ourselves Get down there all the dead people outside Jim you know the ones you shot in the head I don't know what you're talking about. <clears throat> I mean, what was it, huh? What were they trying to do? Get home to their families, maybe bring them back here? But you didn't want that, did you? We just couldn't take the risk. Get up. Wait, wait, wait. I can't. Don't make me. Jim, I'm gonna count to three. No, 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 no. One. You don't understand. Two. Look, don't do this. Three. Open the goddamn door. All right, all right. I hope you know what you're doing. Thank you, Jim. Yes, we know what we're doing. You don't have to do this. Let me go. I'm sorry. We just can't take the risk. Come on. I want to get the hell out of here. It's 
all true. I didn't want to believe it. What are you talking about? God, this is my fault. I, I don't understand. You're I should fault. have seen it when it first went in. I mean, we used to grow wild ginger and, and grape root here. And then all of this changed. They sealed everything off. They took away my clearance. God, David kept telling me. He kept telling me that something was wrong. Okay, okay. Who's, who's David? So David Gorman. He was this research intern. You know what I said? I told him that we're a farm and we're, we're high tech and all that shit and that there are billions of dollars at stake and to just leave it alone. Then he didn't listen. He hacked the system, he got behind the firewall, he told me that this was some sort of classified project or something. I classified don't know. project, just he slow wanted, down and... He wanted to be the next Edward Snowden. You see, he wanted to blow the lid off of this entire thing. David Gorman exposes the evil empire and saves the world and all that shit, and I didn't listen to him, Deacon. I told him that he was being paranoid, and he must have broken in here and then gotten some sample of whatever the hell they were cooking in here. Well, I don't understand. What do you mean? I pieced it together myself a little while later. The night that I was stabbed, I went to the Cloverdale office in farewell, and I went to, to go try and find David, but he was already gone. He'd been gone for two weeks. There was this big green expo in Portland. He must have gone to see a reporter. He was probably infected and he didn't even know it yet. Oh my god. And two days later, two days later, everybody at that conference was infected and then they all got on planes and they went home. And a week later, two and a half billion people were dead. Sarah, this isn't, this couldn't be your fault. I mean, you couldn't have stopped them. You How don't could understand. You have it's, it's the research. My research was a part of this. Deacon, I was a part of this. They, they used me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>